In League of Legends, Thornmail is an item that grants armor and will return magic damage when the champion who purchased it is auto-attacked. Sunfire Cape is an item that grants armor and health and will deal magic damage to enemies near the champion who purchased it. On today's episode of Walmath, we'll be comparing the two to see which item is more cost-efficient for its stats and damage dealing potential. Let's take a look at the items now. Thornmail costs 2200 gold and will grant 100 armor. If a champion with Thornmail is auto-attacked, the auto-attacking champion will be dealt magic damage equal to the damage being dealt times 0.3. One should note, the reflected magic damage is calculated before the Thornmail champion's armor is taken into account. Sunfire Cape costs 2,650 gold and will grant 45 armor and 450 health. Any enemy unit within 400 units of a Sunfire Cape champion will be dealt 40 magic damage per second. If we take the cost of the stats granted by this item into account, one is paying 200 gold for the Thornmail's unique effect and 562 gold for the Sunfire Cape's unique effect. Since the Sunfire Cape will always deal 40 magic damage per second, its unique effect will grant 0.07 damage per gold. In order for Thornmail to deal the same amount of magic damage, the Thornmail champion must receive 133.33 physical damage per second, not considering armor. In order for Thornmail to deal the same amount of magic damage per gold, the Thornmail champion must receive 50 physical damage per second, not considering armor. This is fairly easy since every champion has at least 50 attack damage by level 3. Overall, it would seem Thornmail can easily deal more damage per gold than a Sunfire Cape against a single champion, and possibly more damage overall. However, the Sunfire Cape still has the advantage of dealing damage to multiple champions at once, whether they are auto-attacking or not. Make sure to like this video if you enjoyed it, and subscribe if you'd like to be informed whenever I release new videos. Click the annotation on the screen if you'd like to see the previous Lolmath episode. You can also like Lolmath on Facebook at facebook.com slash trampolinetales and follow me on twitter at twitter.com slash trampolinetales thanks for watching this episode of lolmath